So welcome back to another UDL IRN Network and Learn. Today is the uh, Summit uh, 2016 Roundtable. We have uh, a bunch of our board directors here. So uh, Jamie Basham's here, uh, Denise Coste is here. Uh, I am here in the background, and then uh, we have Alex uh, running our uh, our slideshow. And we're going to get started. I'm going to turn it over to Jamie first uh, to kind of give us an intro and and let us know what's going on. Jamie. Thanks, Brian. Hey, um, I'm just really happy about the upcoming summit and uh, the things that are going to be taking place at the summit. Um, we have a number of things going forward. Um, uh, I'm, I, I'm just floored by the whole thing, actually. <laughs> we have a pre-conference on March 15 that's going to that's going to go over and and the UDL 101. We have a number of we have two model site visits on March 15th as well. And then we have the actual two-day summit uh, with working on networking, implementing, researching, and scaling. So I think it's going to be a great uh, gathering of people. We also then have um, some sponsors this year that are, our sponsorships are opening up with uh, our friends at Goldbook, TextHelp, and then CAST is sponsoring us as well. And we, I know we've had a couple other inquiries recently about some more sponsors, and if you want to do that, uh, people can contact sponsors at udl-irn.org. Right on. I also want to uh, talk about the pre-con. First of all, I, I do want to say that I'm super excited about the uh, the summit coming up too. Uh, to me, uh, the summit uh, represents UDL summer camp, and I, that's what I love most about it. Uh, you find your uh, find your people, you find your tribe, your network, you connect, um, and then it's uh, two days of just incredible learning and incredible hanging out. So, um, with that in mind, we want to welcome in some new people, and we want to do that with the pre-con. So I'm super excited about the pre-con happening, um, and that's happening the day before. <clears throat> Uh, and I guess the biggest thing, thing to remember is if you're new to UDL, the pre-conference uh, is where you want to be, and then you want to stay for the main event. It's an all-day session. We're working with some people from CAST. We're working with Tracy Hall and Mindy Johnson from CAST. They're going to be presenting with Sue Harden and myself. Um, so uh, uh, there's just a couple UDL rock stars. It's just going to be a great time. There's leaders from Cast and, and us uh, teaming up, we're going to provide an overview of, of UDL. We'll explore the guidelines uh, from Cast. We'll discuss how the checkpoints and, and the framework are used to reduce barriers, build lessons, and meet people the needs of all learners, and provide a lot of accessibility. Uh, it provides participants with a conceptual understanding of the UDL framework. And then we're really going to be looking at what are practical st strategies for the beginning of implementation in your district and school. Uh, and this year, we're trying to make it very, very personal, and we're going to start talking about what is your UDL journey, uh, and what does that look like, and what is your inquiry of practice, and how are you going to work with that. So um, if you are new to UDL, make sure you are signing up, because this pre-con is the place to be, UDL 101, UDL Boot Camp, UDL Palooza. You know, the great, you know, another great thing about the, about the summit this year is it's in Towson, at Towson University in Maryland. Uh, where there's a lot of activity going on with UDL. So this is going to be the perfect event. So if you're in the Maryland region, it's still, I mean, if you're anywhere in the, in the world, you can still sign up. We still have a few slots open for people, registrants to come in. But the nice thing is I think we're going to be around a lot of UDL activity because it's right in Maryland uh, where they have a large state initiative around UDL. And that takes us to talking about the model site visits, which is a uh, kind of a first time event for the IRN, but it really was brought about because uh, a lot of our past participants said that they really wanted to sort of see UDL in action. So we asked some of the schools in Maryland that um, who have been um, uh, uh, implementing uh, UDL for four years or more um, to be uh, uh, host to uh, model site visits. And I had a number of schools that volunteered to, to do this for us. So we have two schools in Baltimore, um, and we're going to be, um, so you have the option to visit some classrooms in Baltimore where the teachers have been implementing it for four years or more. And then there's a school in Montgomery County. They've been um, scaling it throughout the school for up to almost five years now. So you have the option to visit a school in um, Montgomery County. Now these aren't just uh, kind of you walk through the school and you get to peek in the windows. This is not what that is. This is meeting with uh, the school staff at the, at the beginning um, of, at the mo in the morning um, and really getting a sense of what the, their journey has been. 
but also it's kind of a structured uh, um, observation. So you will actually walk through with uh, a structured observation chart. It's kind of almost a um, serves as kind of a, a check on fidelity of implementation. It's what they use very often um, to uh, when they have visitors walk through. We, they ask uh, these visitors to uh, make observations uh, as to what they see as they walk through these classrooms. So you'll be actually be going through and using this to kind of a checklist uh, um, to observe what goes on, what you see, and to sort of uh, take notice of what you see going on in these classrooms. And then you'll have an opportunity to come back over lunch and really share your observations. What did you see? What didn't you see? And have an opportunity to to really share your your thoughts, uh, your to uh, ask questions of the staff. So it's a great opportunity to really talk uh, about. UDL in action. So I'm um, hoping that um, um, you'll sign up for the uh, model site visits because they're just a fabulous opportunity, kind of a, a, a new opportunity for the IRN and we hope to have uh, um, lots of people sign up for them because I think they'll, be a, they'll just be a, a really great time. And, the, and then afterwards, um, those who are going back to the hotel um, in, in getting ready for the summit, back to the Towson Marriott, we're going to have a Socratic circle where we can really sit around and really uh, talk um, more about these model site visits and we can share impressions across um, both, sets, both sets of schools, both the Baltimore County and the Montgomery County schools, and talk about um, other implementation issues um, as, as uh, everyone sees fit. So that's uh, information about the model site visits. What else we got? Ah, yes, the big reveal. Brian. So here's, yep, here is the big reveal. So last year we had a great crusader, and so then this year we want to introduce a new crusader, um, the mysterious UDL Crusader uh, 2.0 for 2016, um, which will be tied to the Crusader game yet again. I don't want to give you give away too much on that one uh, because it's going to be exciting and fast paced. So. Uh, we've got we've got our badging system that we had from last year, and, and so that we can socially promote each other, which is a fantastic way to connect with others at the summit. Um, and then we've got our online game that uh, we're going to be working through, so that you can become a UDL Crusader yourself. Uh, and that's uh, that's the whole point of this design. You'll notice that there's a there's a faceplate there, so you can't really see in because the idea is that we're all Crusaders and we can all be Crusaders. Um, so uh, welcome the new 2016 Crusader. Um, to sit next next to the 2015 Crusader. There we go. All right, love it. So I'm really excited about the slate of speakers for this year because we had lots of great submissions. We were not able to accept all of the submissions that we got, so just had lots of great choices. Um, we have way over 50 speakers, something like 50 or 60 speakers this year. Um, this uh, we all we still have the UDL talks, which are kind of call to action. 18-minute um, call-to-action kind of uh, talks. We also have uh, the breakout sessions again. Uh, lots of great topics from preschool to um, uh, K-12 topics, uh, higher ed topics, uh, research topics, a principal perspectives, student perspectives. So lots of good topics. And if you go to the IRN website and click on the summit schedule, you can really get uh, sort of get a rundown of, of the topics that are going to be offered in during the the main two days of the summit. So go take a look at those those topics there and get excited about what's uh, what's going to happen. Um, let's see. Uh, so there, are just a slide. It's a sort of kind of a, a bit of a summary slide of what's going to happen there. That really, the the the, the IRN summit is really about networking and lots of opportunities to network with people. So the UDL talks. Uh, we'll also have design labs. Brian's going to talk a little bit about the design labs. Uh, this uh, we're going to have some crowdsourcing and get your opinions on things um, uh, to help inform the UDI our, the UDL IRN going forward, um, and uh, lots of uh, interactive kinds of activities that we've built into the program this year. So uh, we want you to come out to the uh, to the summit, have a great time. Um, we always try to insert a lot of fun into what we're doing. The, we like to consider ourselves the unconference, um, and uh, so come on down. And uh, uh, Brian, let's talk about the design labs. I think that's next. I got, I got to tell you, uh, Denise, I got to take a minute here because uh, my mind's already blown. Uh, so I got to put it back together with all the stuff that we already have going on. But uh, this year we're going to introduce um, uh, design labs as well. So we're going to have three different opportunities over the course of of the uh, summit itself. Um, one that is going to be a general, then then two uh, topic specific uh, around research and and higher ed and teacher prep. Um, so if you haven't been to a design lab before. Um, 
and you haven't you haven't seen people talking about them, uh, then then you are in for a treat. If you have, then you know what's coming your way. So we have it's a very unconference feel, as you can tell by some of the photographs that we have here. Um, and what it does is it really honors the space and time to design and think uh, for practitioners. Uh, so it's a, and it's a great way to to connect with others and work on work on inquiry questions that you have and questions of your own practice and try to um, try to design and build. Uh, so we really are honoring the idea of the designer within the context of the design itself. So uh, it's a great way to grow and connect with your network. Um, and if you if you are just building your network, you definitely got to be at one of these things. Or if you already have an established network, guess what? You really got to be at one of these things. So uh, it's a lot of energy. It's uh, it's I like to call it Design Labs or Hype Planet because it's a it's just all that much fun. So come on down, uh, and they're they're during the the summit themselves. All right, and if that's not enough uh, to get you to come to the uh, um, 2016 UDL IRN Summit, uh, we also wait, have wait wait wait, Denise, there's more. There's more. There's more. <laughs> There's more. Yeah. We it just have keeps our, on giving. It just keeps on giving. It just keeps on coming. So we have our networking meet and greet dinners. We actually have two meet and greet dinners this year because they've been so popular. We have one for Tuesday night, um, which is following the pre-conference and the model site visits. And that one's going to feature our very, very famous Maryland Crab Cakes. Um, it's kind of a family-style dinner at a local restaurant. It's going to be great. Um, and then when you sign up for the meet and greet dinners, um, know that those dinners include tax, gratuity. So it's a really good deal because it's you know it's uh, you know it's appetizers, it's salad, it's it's a full meal, but it all the price includes is all inclusive. Um, and then um, on so that's uh, meet and greet on Tuesday night. And then there's another meet and greet dinner at a really terrific uh, venue at the university that overlooks the stadium at the university, um, and um, called the Minigan Room. And but that it begins with a happy hour first at the Marriotts, and that that happy hour is free. So we hope to see everybody at the happy hour, um, getting happy. And then after that, the shuttle bus will pick us up and take those who have registered for the dinner over to the Minigan room. And the, um, that's a meal. You'll have a choice of uh, entree. Um, and again, that's uh, uh, salad right on to choice of desserts and. Uh, again, the price is all inclusive. So uh, the dinners are just a great informal way to sort of sit around and get to know lots of people informally. Uh, you get around to, to sit around and and hug David Rose or Jamie Basham or uh, Brian Dean or anyone else who you so want to hug and uh, uh, just have a have a good time and talk about anything you want to talk about. Uh, I, th I think Brian is the official hugger actually of the summer. I think David it? Rose is the official I mean, hugger. Yeah, yeah, I, think, I think he is too. I think he is too. So are you are you are, are do you feel safe, Denise, in saying that this is really the UDL Night of Stars? At oh least my gosh! Years, would you would you say that? Absolutely. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get out some. Some stars for the table. Now that you've said right. that, right. Just... And and you and Jamie, you are you are going to be part of the the UDL uh, the UDL auction, right? Did I just freeze up? <laughs> oh, he's acting like he froze up, folks. But uh, but he's going to be auctioning off uh, some of his many talents. He says. <laughs> oh yeah, we have a, we actually have a surprise built into the to the uh, let's see the the. There's the Wednesday night meet and uh, greet and dinner. Well, we're not even gonna we're not even gonna tell anybody about that one because that's you a real. You just gotta story. come. You just gotta oh. come. What happens at the meet and greet stays at the meet and greet or not. Right. Exactly. Welcome social media. That's right. <laughs> what goes on at the meet and greet stays at the meet and greet for sure. Yep. All righty. So, well, speaking of social media, I just want to drop this quick plug. Um, so the hashtag for the summit. If you can't make it to the summit. Uh, and you are forlorn, and you are sitting on your couch, and you're wondering, what am I going to do with my life? Jumping on Twitter using the hashtag 20, uh, #UDLIRN2016 um, is going to get you all of the information you need, and it's going to feel like you're as close to being there as possible. As well as that Wednesday, we have a UDL chat, uh, hashtag #UDL chat that Mindy and I will be co-hosting right from the IRN, right from the IRN summit itself. We'll be playing around with Periscope and doing lots of fun and cool stuff. So. Both of those are things that you definitely want to check out as well. Um, again, the hashtag UDL IRN 2016 um, and hashtag UDL chat will get you all of that great UDL goodness. So I didn't want to, there we go. I'm going to pass that back on to Jamie to talk about this uh, last portion here. I, I think it's just a slide. I, I, um, 
I want to commend the person who designed this slide. It's 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 <laughs> quite explicit. Uh, well, so. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Basically, if you want the point, links to get to stuff, it points right to the uh, to the IRN website, and everything can be located there. So I think it's right. it's perfect. For right. All. If you want to sign up for the dinners, you can uh, see the links there. If you want to sign up for the model site visits, if you want to register for the pre-conference or register for the conference, all the all the links are there. You can go straight to the IRN website. All That's the right. That's that to me is the best bet. Go straight to the IRN website. You will get all of the IRN goodness and gooiness uh, and warm, fuzzy <laughs> feeling right there. It's a brilliant site. It's beautiful. You need to be there. Can, Alex, can you throw back up the sponsors real quick for us? That sponsor slide. Look at it. She's fantastic. Again, Jamie, do you want to give a shout out to the to the yeah, sponsors? Once we again? just really want to thank our sponsors this year, uh, Goldbook. Text help and cast for all they've done for us, um, and we hope that we hope we see a lot of people at, at Towson, Maryland. Uh, we March. also want to thank we also want to thank Towson, Maryland, because they have well, been terrific. Yeah, Towson, Towson is going to open the doors for us to kind of come in as a as a nonprofit to host the summit. So we really appreciate everything they've done for us, uh, and including loaning us people to uh, to be able to do this in space, obviously. So, I, you know, I'm just really excited about it. I'm excited about the entire thing. Um, and now that I know there's a surprise that's waiting on Wednesday night at the at the meet and greet, I'm a little um, concerned as well. But that, <laughs> that's, but you know, but um, but that but that's the fun of it. That's really kind of the fun of it. So I think I think we have a great. Um, a great summit ahead of us, and we're looking forward to seeing a lot of people there. That's right, UDL IRN Summit 2016. If you have not signed up yet, those, those well, good luck because you because there's going to be a mass rush to get to the site. So you might as well jump on right now. You don't even have to listen to the end of this. Just get there now. Get I mean, there in, now. In reality, Brian. In reality, this this you know. In reality, we have. Uh, we have some slots open still, so we're looking for them to fill up. Um, but I can tell you that slots are filling up, and so there's not many. So please, um, please get there as soon as you can and get yourself registered at QDL IRN Summit 2016.